A complete dilated eye exam lets the eye doctor diagnose common vision problems, those that can be corrected with glasses or contact lenses, as well as diseases of the eye. The most common vision problems are nearsightedness, farsightedness, astigmatism, and presbyopia, or the need for reading glasses. The easiest way to understand common vision problems, those that can be corrected with glasses and contact lenses, is through a drawing. Here I'm going to draw the front of the eye, called the cornea, and the rest of the eye. Light enters the eye through the cornea. It's focused by the lens and comes onto the retina in a normal eye that has no prescription error. The focus will be sharp on the retina. In an eye that's nearsighted, the light will bend too steeply and by the time it reaches the retina, be out of focus. In farsightedness, the light hasn't yet reached its focus by the time it reaches the retina, so the image is blurry. Astigmatism is another common vision problem that's corrected with glasses and contact lenses. In astigmatism, the cornea is unevenly shaped with one side steeper than the other, so it's shaped actually a little more like a football than a basketball and as a result the image is blurry when it reaches the retina. Presbyopia is a natural aging change of the eye where the lens is no longer able to change focus to see up close. After about the age of 40 people notice that the print in newspapers and books is blurry and they may feel eye strain or headaches when trying to read up close. This is most commonly corrected with eyeglasses. Sometimes people don't know that they're not seeing as well as they could, and other times people could have early changes from an eye disease that only a dilated eye exam could reveal. So if you haven't had a dilated exam with your eye doctor, you're recommended to have one.